my time. Uh, just to make Captain Davis informed the Cabinet that it was very important to enhance the Council's scrutiny function so that it could influence policy formation. <coughs> well, Mr. Mayor, I've got questions regarding that. Phil, I wonder if you could give me the, the courtesy in your right of reply, just to confirm for me who is driving this agenda through Council. Um, we have to be clear, we've been told from a number of uh, elements that we should let the Council run its course and then hold those responsible to account if it goes wrong. I expect you to stand up in a few minutes and say that you're driving this agenda because you're the leader of this Council. However, I have my doubts. You need to be really careful when you put your hand up in a show of unity and leadership that you're making the right decision. It's, there's a, a really famous and silly example of a man who put his hand up, lots of people who put their hand up in a show of unity, and that was Iron Spartacus. But they got it wrong and they were all crucified for making the wrong decision. And this will go wrong. This will go wrong. <laughs> It just doesn't work. 
Mr. Mayor, this change is wrong, it's a retrograde step and it's being forced through for the wrong reason. So I urge this council to consider this very, very carefully and vote with our amendment, Mr. Mayor. Yeah.